Hey there, aspiring developers. Ready to become a Python full stack developer? Let's dive into the ultimate guide to mastering this in-demand skill. First things first, what is a Python full stack developer? Simply put, it's a developer who works on both the front end and back end of web applications using Python and other technologies. This means you'll handle everything from user interfaces to server side logic and databases. So what do you need to learn? Let's break it down step by step. Start with understanding the core concepts of Python variables, data types, loops, functions. Get comfortable with libraries like NumPy and Pandas. These are your front-end essentials. HTML for structure, CSS for styling, and JavaScript for interactivity. Dive into frameworks like React or Angular to build dynamic user interfaces. Here's where Python shines. Learn Flask or Django for setting up your server-side logic. Understand how to work with databases like SQL and NoSQL. Get familiar with RESTful APIs. You need to track changes in your code. Git is the go-to tool for this. Learn how to create repositories, branch, merge, and handle pull requests on GitHub. Learn to set up and manage web servers. Familiarize yourself with deployment tools like Docker, Kubernetes, and cloud services like AWS or Heroku. Theory is great, but practice is crucial. Start with small projects like a personal blog, then move on to more complex applications like e-commerce sites. This will not only solidify your skills, but also build your portfolio. Technology evolves constantly. Stay updated with the latest trends and tools. Join developer communities, attend webinars, and contribute to open source projects. Remember, becoming a Python full-stack developer is a journey. It takes time, effort, and a lot of coding, but the reward is a versatile skill set that opens up a world of opportunities. Stay motivated, keep coding, and don't be afraid to ask for help when you need it. That's all for today. If you found this guide helpful, hit the like button and subscribe for more developer tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching. Catch you in the next video.